This video is for educational purposes only. It is not medical advice. Retitrutide is an approved, available, or safe to order from sketchy research sites. If your so-called pharmacy uses a Gmail address, that's not innovation, that's a scam. Ozempic made headlines. Manjaro took it further. And now there's a molecule scientists are calling the most powerful metabolic drug ever tested in humans. Meet Retitrutide, the triple G. Three hormones, one shot, and a data curve that basically drop kicked the bathroom scale. But with great signaling comes great side effects. So why is everyone losing their minds over this thing? Semaglutide and terzepatide proved it. Obesity isn't a failure of willpower. It's a hormone problem. Flip the right receptor and metabolism changes like software. Retitrutide takes the idea and adds one more line of code. Instead of hitting one receptor, it hits three. GLP-1, GIP, and glucagon. Think of it as a remix where hunger, insulin, and fat burning all drop the beat at once. Here's how the symphony works. GLP-1 slows stomach emptying and tells your brain you're full. GIP fine-tunes insulin to smooth out blood sugar spikes. Glucagon is a plot twist. It boosts energy burn by nudging the liver to melt stored fat. Together, it's an appetite control plus internal furnace. You eat less and burn more. In mice, that mass plummeted. In humans, the question was whether the triple synergy could survive reality. In Lilly's New England Journal of Medicine Phase 2 trial, 338 adults with obesity received weekly injections for 48 weeks. The results were wild. Average weight loss at the top dose was roughly around 24%, about 60 pounds for some participants. In comparison, semaglutide averaged 15% and terzepatide hit 22. Retitutride's curve was still trending downwards when the study ended. Researchers literally stopped the trial before the weight loss did. Early data also showed improved liver fat, insulin sensitivity, and lipid profiles, hinting that it's more than vanity weight, that it's whole body metabolic recalibration. The secret sauce is the glucagon plot twist. GLP-1 and GIP make you store less and eat less. Glucagon says, let's burn some fuel. That tug of war could be what drives deeper fat oxidation and stable glucose control. It's like tuning your metabolism from eco mode to sport mode without blowing the engine. At least that's a theory. The hype isn't just about the data. It's about what it represents. For pharma, Retitrutide is the template for the next generation of metabolic drugs. For investors, it's a trillion dollar signal. And for biohackers, it's forbidden fruit. Triple agonist threads are exploding on Reddit. And every week, another vendor pops up selling mystery peptides labeled Retitrutide. And with big effects come big trade-offs. Common side effects include nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea. It's your GI tract learning a new operating system. Most side effects fade with slow titration, but the early weeks can be rough. Then there's lean mass loss. About a quarter to a third of total weight loss is muscle, similar to other GLP-1 drugs. But when that total number is huge, so is that loss. And unfortunately, access to Retitrutide is quite limited. There's no legitimate consumer supply until the FDA gives the green light. If Retitrutide delivers, it'll mark the start of multi-agonist medicine, stacking hormonal pathways for precision metabolic control. And it's not alone. Amgen's AMG-133, Viking's VK-2735, and Altamune's Pembitatide are all chasing the same goal. A metabolic cocktail that reprograms how we store and burn energy. We're watching the shift from dieting to data-driven metabolism design. It's biotech's boldest move yet, and possibly its riskiest. Retitrutide is making waves because it's not just another weight loss drug. It's the next logical step in hacking human metabolism. The potential is staggering, and so are the unknowns. But if this triple agonist era lives up to the hype, today's miracle drugs are going to look like dial-up internet in comparison. This is Biohack Stack. 
coding the edge of human optimization, where every molecule tells a story, and sometimes that story rewrites the news. If you enjoyed this breakdown, tap like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you don't miss the next drop. Because the next molecule we cover might just rewrite you 